Hello my friends, welcome on Tips to Fix. On this video tutorial today, I will show you how to connect and how to use Atem Mini Pro. Here it is, I love this device, it's Atem Mini Pro. It's professional one. It's from Blackmagic Design. They did very good job with uh, this Atem Mini Pro. I will unbox this Atem Mini Pro right now and I will show you what's inside and also I will show you today how to connect this Atem Mini Pro with both of these cameras with the one you are looking to me and the other one I have it here and I will show you how to live stream on Facebook also in the same time on YouTube what to use and every detail don't forget to subscribe tips to fix and uh, continue watching it okay here it is let's open up the box Atem Mini Pro what we have inside okay look at this we have power charger it's nice it's 12 volt we have power charger we have connector european american uk connector i will use this european and here it is just power connector is ready let's open up the box oh here it is look at this guy <laughs> a 10 mini pro Okay, let's remove the box. So here it is, guys. This Atem Mini Pro. This is the front view of this device. On the front view, and here is the back view. You will see the back view. So what do we have here? We have two uh, small microphone inputs. Microphone one and microphone two, okay? So we don't have to use these uh, microphone inputs that much uh, because we get the audio from HDMI we have uh, um, four cameras input with HDMI camera 1 camera 2 camera 3 and camera 4 also with HDMI out connector here we will connect the screen with this and we will see the multi view of these cameras because we have a 10 mini pro as some more features than uh, a 10 mini because it has multi view it has multi view for cameras and I will show you later how to connect it but I'm just explaining for the moment also we have USB out is USB-C and in, I love it it's professional with this USB-C we can use it for uh, two purposes. one purpose is we can connect a 10 mini pro with computer we can connect this with uh, live Facebook and live YouTube later but only with this connector okay guys so we need to connect this with computer you have to have USB-C cable and I have it here it's not included on the box you have to buy an, or use your phone connector is the same thing and here it is the Atem Mini Pro controller in this controller is LAN network with this you can connect the Atem Mini Pro on the internet and from here we will do that streaming online okay and the other one is a power connector so we will connect this now for the moment I just connect the power and here it is and uh, we will be ready to use this device with connecting this with this both of these cameras and uh, also I will show you how to uh, live stream on Facebook and on uh, YouTube in the same time so here here it is I just turn it on and uh, here it is look at this look at this guys it looks nice and uh, very beautiful lights on the on the camera buttons okay it, it looks professional okay I will connect this now I will connect here uh, first camera I put the first camera here with HDMI and the other one I will put this on the camera look at this guys what we have here on this multi-view monitor we have camera 1 camera 2 you see camera 2, camera 3 and camera 4 if I remove this from camera 1 and put it here on the camera 2 I just I just have the view here on the camera 2 as you see and if I click here the, the button 2 you will see camera 2 on the program on live here is the preview here is the live program okay guys so uh, this is how we connect 
cameras on the ATEM, ATEM Mini Pro. This is my friend who's helping me on this video tutorial. So let's connect camera 2. I will put here the other camera. We can put here camera 2 now on the mixer, okay, on the ATEM Mini Pro. And we will have two video. Oh, look at this. Now we have two cameras, camera 1 and camera 2. Nice. This is how you connect two cameras, but also if you have more, more than one camera or more than two cameras, you will connect it all together. Okay, guys? So let's go now and live Facebook directly with this device. Let's go on. The next step is installing software on your computer and doing the live stream on Facebook or uh, YouTube. Okay, let's continue. So what we need right now, we just go here on the, let's go on the Google. Let's go on the Google here and let's search for Atem Mini Pro to PC. Okay, guys? And what we have here, let's go here, Atem Mini support. Let's go here on the support. Here on the support, we need to download the, so the software. Here it is, last to download. We don't need DaVinci, Hyperdesk, but Atem Mini Switch 8.5 update. Choose for Windows or for your OS. In my case, let's use on the Windows. I will. I need to download that. Just download only download. And here it is. Save it on your computer. It's 1.3 gigs. In my case, it needs only two minutes to download. So after you download the software, we need to install this software. Okay. Just open up. Like magic installation. Okay, click next, click next, click I accept. Click next, click install. Okay. And click finish. It will ask you for restart and you click yes to this. You need to restart your computer. So here it is. Let's just go here on the start. Search for attempt. Here it is. ATEM Software Control. Open up. ATEM Soft Control. What we have to do now, we have to connect this USB-C cable with computer. Okay? Let's put it here on the, on the back. USB out here. I just connected here. USB out. Okay. And we will connect this now on the computer directly here on the front. On the front of the computer. Here it is. I just connected. And you will see, you will see here on the screen, a Temini Pro connect and here it is voila we have here a 10 mini pro software connected with a 10 mini and i can manage a 10 mini pro cameras on uh, on the screen on the on the monitor okay here is the uh, everything you need to have and here is the live stream area i will choose facebook twitch youtube twitter periscope and restream io if we need to stream on two platforms directly facebook and youtube in the same time 
Twitch in the same time, Twitter in the same time, we have to use Restream.io. Uh, we have to create a profile on this website and uh, we will be able to choose with the last software of A10 Mini Pro. We will be able, as you see it here, to choose Restream I.O. and we will send the signal, we will send the video, we will send the video on, uh, on Restream and Restream will send the video on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Periscope and whatever. So if we only need, if we only want to stream on Facebook, we just choose Facebook here. If we only like to stream on YouTube, we just choose YouTube here. Okay guys, in my case, Facebook here okay and server default and we need to paste the key the key here let's go on the facebook now let's try with live here and we will try to go live on the facebook with these cameras okay we need to copy the stream key it needs the stream key i just copy the stream key here and paste it here on the Atem Mini Pro stream, uh, stream strength streaming high let's keep it on medium okay click on air from here and here it is Atem Mini Pro is blinking so we are on the air as you see let's see on the Facebook now waiting for the video Let's see, we have any video. Use streaming key. I chose use streaming key. Mm -hmm. Waiting for the video. So make sure guys you connect Atem Mini Pro through the internet using Atem Mini Pro controller. Don't forget to, to connect Atem Mini Pro with internet, okay? If we don't have any internet connected with A10 Mini Pro, we are not able to stream directly live on Facebook. Okay, guys? So, see me on the Facebook. And look at this. It's nice. The broadcast has been paused. Okay? So, let's choose the quality. Let's send the streaming. Display the status. Let's, let's go now and click on the air. So, let's see on the Facebook. So this is how we go live from Atem Mini Pro to Facebook using Atem Mini Pro software. So thank you guys for watching. This is how we uh, use this uh, Blackmagic Design uh, Atem Mini Pro for live streaming on the Facebook. It's the same thing on YouTube. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any other questions, just write me a comment and I will let you know everything you need to know. So God bless you and see you on the next video tutorial.